Have you ever felt alone in a room full of people? Do you feel as if nobody truly understands you? Do you feel empty, lost, hopeless or worthless? Does your anxiety stop you from doing things you want to do in your life? Are you depressed and don't know who to turn to for help or guidance? Are you currently struggling with your mental health? You never have to feel alone again. We understand you. We feel exactly like you do and we are here to support you. Share your story, connect with like-minded people, learn more about mental illnesses and how you can improve your mental health. Together, we can make a difference and together, we can reduce the stigma. Welcome to Authentic Mental Health. More than 264 million people worldwide suffer from depression. Depression isn't someone who is just sad. Sadness is a normal human emotion that everybody experiences from time to time. And someone who is sad usually isn't sad for more than a few days. Depression, on the other hand, is not a normal human emotion. Depression is a mental health disorder which is classified as a mood disorder. Depression doesn't last for a few days like sadness. Depression can cause long-lasting symptoms such as overwhelming sadness, low energy, loss of appetite, and a lack of interest in things that used to bring pleasure and joy. Studies have shown that women are twice as likely as men to be diagnosed with depression. Depression can affect anybody at any stage in their life. It doesn't matter where you live, how much money you earn or have, what color you are, what religion you believe in. Depression can and does affect anyone in the world. Common symptoms of depression include persistent sadness, feeling empty, feeling hopeless, helpless, or worthless, loss of interest in activities you once enjoyed, appetite or weight changes, sleep changes, anger or irritability, loss of energy, concentration problems, and unexplained aches and pains. Everybody at some point during their lives may relate or experience some of these symptoms, and everybody feels down from time to time. But how do you know if you're depressed or not? This depression test will reveal if you're likely or unlikely to be depressed. You are going to be asked 10 questions. Please answer these questions truthfully and honestly. The 10 questions are based over the past two weeks of your life and you are going to answer with either yes or no. Number one, have you been feeling down, hopeless, or worthless? Number two, have you had problem falling or staying asleep or sleeping too much? Number three, have you had little interest or pleasure in doing things? Number four, have you had a poor appetite or been overeating? Number five, have you been feeling bad about yourself, like you're a failure or let your family down? Number six, have you struggled to concentrate? Number seven, have you felt angry or irritable? Number eight, have you withdrawn from society, your family, or your friends? Number nine, have you put on a happy face to hide your feelings from others? Number 10, is it difficult to remember the last time you were happy? If you answered yes to one or less of these questions, it's unlikely you're depressed. If you answered yes to two or more of these questions, it is possible that you are in fact depressed. However, depression varies from person to person. If you answered yes to two or more of these questions, or if you even answered yes to none of these questions, but you think you might be depressed, I would highly recommend you speak to a doctor or a mental health professional so you can get properly diagnosed. 
You can speak to a mental health professional immediately by clicking the link in the description box down below right now, where you'll be able to be properly diagnosed and be given the help you need and deserve with your depression, if that's what you are in fact suffering from, and be able to get your life back on track. The link is in the description box down below. Please do not self-diagnose yourself from this test. This test is to see if you need to seek help for the way you're currently feeling. I now want to hear from you guys and girls in the comment section down below. What did you score on this test? Have you previously been diagnosed with depression before? Do you think you're currently depressed but you haven't been diagnosed properly yet? Let me and others know in the comment section down below and let's show others they are not alone going through this. If you found this video helpful and useful, please give this video a like. If you're new here, make sure you're subscribed to Authentic Mental Health to join a community of like-minded people just like you. Take care guys and girls, and I'll see you all again in another video.